But demographics is, is not destiny, um, or not necessarily destiny. Uh, but, but it does shape uh, potentially virtually every dimension of public uh, and, and private life. Um, public budgets, uh, government budgets in most developed countries are dominated by age-related spending. Um, e even in the United States, entitlements for the elderly uh, are now nearly uh, 50 percent um, of non-interest spending uh, in the federal budget and will be heading higher. Demography shapes the size um, and composition uh, of, of, of public spending. Um, it potentially limits our uh, uh, abilities to invest uh, in the young, to invest in the future. Um, it, beyond budgets, it, it has important implications, as we've seen, uh, for, for economic uh, growth. Uh, demography, uh, through the changing age structure of the population, affects rates of savings and investment. Through the rate of growth in the population, it affects long-term returns to, 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 to capital, um, and, and, and hence uh, uh, the profitability um, uh, of, of industry and business, um, and the direction, uh, the magnitude and direction of global capital flows. Um, it, sh it can shape potentially the uh, uh, social um, and, and political mood. Uh, in, in a word, you, you cannot understand um, the future uh, without understanding um, demography. Now, there are other things that matter, of course. Technology matters. Um, what happens to the environment um, matters. Religion matters. Uh, but even here, even with technology, even with the environment, even with religion, there are feedback loops to, to, uh, to demography, uh, to population age structure, to population growth, and, and to differential population growth. Um, so I think, I, th I think any uh, uh, long-term future scan um, really does need to begin uh, with the fundamental human uh, input. Um, and, 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 to under, and to understand uh, that we need to look at these underlying demographic trends.